YouTube, kiss my cupcake here, and uh, today we're gonna give you the Pop Goes the Weasel Achievement Guide. So, uh, yeah. Really, really easy achievement, actually. You get a lot of, uh, achievements doing it. You get, like, five of them. So, yeah, and, uh, also the first step to do the Easter egg is, uh, you gotta get the Hell's Retriever, so, if you don't know how to get that... I'll put a link in the description below and an annotation or something. And uh, so uh, let's get started with the Easter egg. So again, like I said, the first thing you gotta do is get the Hell's Retriever. So if you don't know how to do that, look at the Purgatory symbol and there will be an annotation. Look at it. So uh, next step you're gonna want to do is go to the Golden Gate Bridge three times you gotta complete the cycle three times that's an achievement by itself I think that's like 30 so plus going there uh, the first time that's like a hundred gamer score already so yeah plus the Hell's Retriever that's a, I'm not gonna count gamer score for you guys freaking go check your own achievements alright anyways besides that so yeah once you are at the Golden Gate Bridge, kill yourself, spawn back in Alcatraz Island. Yeah. Actually, I think you can do this achievement multiple times, anyways, to uh, help people if they weren't in the game. So, I think you can do that. I don't think it's a one-time thing like in transit or something. But anyways, next thing you're going to want to do is come by the Warden's office and uh, go in one of the cells and knock down the poster with your Hell's Retriever. Then go into Afterlife and there will be a new portal to the wall right be, right next to you. Then if you go to the skull that I just passed up, there will be a spoon right next to it. And you shock the spoon until there is a uh, evil laugh. <laughs> and uh, so yeah, that's that. Then you will come over here where you see a spork right by this window in the cafeteria you go use your tomahawk and voila you'll hear the um warden talk and he will be like rah, 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 101 and yeah so then come by the olympia and uh use your tomahawk on that skull and you will find it that's the only to that's actually the only skull you can see with your eye because the rest of the skulls you're going to collect, you cannot see them. You have to go into Purgatory to see them. But I got you covered. And uh, next one is going to be on the roof, uh, right in the corner, bottom left corner, or top left corner, or top right, whatever you want to call it. And right there, he gets it. And right there. Next one is uh, in the warden's office. Uh, right right by a window, use your tomahawk on one of those electric cable things, and yeah, that's that. Next one, you gotta go all the way down to the docks, and it'll be on one of those, uh, one of those pole thingies right next to Mule Kick and Flopper. Hi, Mule Kick and Flopper. Um, yeah. So, the last one is gonna be by Jug. This one's a bit tricky, actually. You have to jump, I think. Well, I think I jumped, but anyways... Uh, I, pret I bet it's pretty easy if you jump. But yeah, you gotta jump and get it. And uh, you can do it on the gondola, but that's a waste of money and you'll probably miss because you're moving and stuff. And it's just better that way. Yeah. Fade out. Go into the next... Okay, we're in the next one. So, uh... Then if you come by the warden's office, once you got all those skulls, there will be a uh, blunder get waiting for your taking... And, uh, yeah, now you got another Blunder Gat. If you, you know, if you actually have the Acid Gat and then you get the Blunder Gat from that, you can have an Acid Gat and a Blunder Gat, which is pretty cool. I don't feel the need to make a video on that because that's, I, I'm just lazy. Okay, so next you're going to come by the Citadel Tunnels, and, uh, what you're going to want to do is shock yourself, go down to the number dial thing, and you will have to type a combination of numbers in this order. Uh, it's the numbers that the wardens say, but again, I got you covered. So the first number you're going to want to type is going to be 101. Also, make sure that these uh, these numbers are flashing like that. So again, 101 is the first number. And uh, 
yeah, a little nice strategy that I'm doing right now is uh, just revive yourself and then halfway, don't revive, then stop, then revive, then stop, revive. The next number, by the way, is 872. 872, people. 872! Okay, so the next number is 386. 386. Thres. It's six. Okay, and then four, eight, one. And then after that, enjoy a little too. participation in the murder, the three collaborators were sent to death by electric chair. Justice came swiftly. On the morning of January 19, 1934, the execution order was carried out. Okay, so if you didn't get all that, uh, I'm gonna make a video pretty soon explaining all that. And uh, so the last part of the Easter egg is you're gonna have to go, one, only one person is gonna have to go into purgatory. And uh, enter the plane. Make sure all uh, the other people are on the roof, because I don't think it works if you're not on the roof. But anyways, yeah. And then everyone else will go into purgatory mode all 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 automatically. Yes. And then you could all go deep sea diving underwater. So yeah. Uh. So let's just wait. Do 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 do. Do, 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 do. Okay, the Golden Gate Bridge, we're gonna hit it. And then your bodies will be in the electric chairs. That's how you break the cycle, because you're not respawning in Alcatraz, you're respawning in the Golden Gate Bridge, and then you gotta kill everyone. <laughs> so, that's that. And now it becomes a whole team deathmatch thing. And this didn't last too long, I mean, it's a 3v1. And, uh, I didn't have double time. And I sort of can't move that fast with this so yeah I'm gonna die as you can see the kill things go up there and uh, the cycle continues <laughs> what that basically means is well you'll see in a video coming up pretty soon 
But if you didn't see that, here's a th here's a free camera thing replay. And uh, basically, Andres is a sneaky little bastard and comes up behind me. And, uh, yeah. Gay ass. <sighs> we are so doing this egg again, and he's gonna be weasel. But yeah, as you can see, death to all. So, guys, that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the Easter egg. Ooh, little camera glitch right there. But, uh, anyways, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.